This is a Minecraft build battle, but I got secret x-ray goggles in order to cheat. My build is looking so good. Hey, Melon, if I guess what you build, you'll have to give me all of your diamonds. Fine. I think it's a giant subscribe button. Press it right now to get goaded. <laughs> Dang it, not my diamonds. Hey, Quandale, I've got some super cool items here for sale. I got the engineer's goggles and x-ray glasses. X-ray goggles? Wasn't I the one who sold you those before? Besides, what's the point of x-ray goggles? I'm not a cheater anyway. But Quandale, they let you see through objects, and these one let you engineer incredible builds. Sorry, pal, but you're barking up the wrong tree. I'm just not really interested in buying junk. Ah, oh, dang it, Quandale, I want to get rich. Hey, Sonny, what are you doing at Quandale? Ah! What was that? I have no idea. What the heck? It sounded like it came from over the mountains. Okay, I'm right behind you. Dude, that was insane. That sounded like a thousand TNTs went off all at once. Dude, what do you think happened? It sounded like something crashed. Oh, uh, Sonny? What the heck is this? Whoa! It looks like a meteor site. It must have crash landed right in the middle. Ow! Sonny, chill. What the heck? Yo, I think I see something. Something in the center of the crater. Yeah. Dibs! I saw it first. It's mine. No, Sonny, that's not how this works. Come on, come on, come on. I got there first. It's mine. You'll die for it. No, no, Sonny, I got here. No, no, no. Sonny, 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 chill. Chill, 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 chill. Sonny. Back off. That's what I thought. This is my meteorite. Nope, it's mine, Sonny. There's only one way to settle this. Through an epic build battle. If that's what you want, Melon, it's on. One versus is one. Let's do this thing. Ow, chill, chill, chill. Whoa, we got Dondale Pringleton the Wise to be the judge? Dude, Dondale, what are we building first? All right, fellas, the theme for the first round is ground vehicles, so you need to create a cool car or something like that. Whoa, land vehicles? Like sports cars? Oh, I'm gonna destroy you, Melon. Or like Sonny <laughs> splatting on the ground? Yo, chill! Hey. Yeah, I got creative. Thank you, Dondale. Dang it. Whatever. It's time to build the most epic land vehicle ever. Sonny, you're going down. That's what you think. Guys, he has no idea. I tried to sell these to Quandale, but it didn't work out. So now I have x-ray glasses and engineer goggles. I am going to absolutely destroy Melon. Okay, guys. For round number one, I'm going to build the most awesome train ever. Here we go. I have a vision. I think if I build it like this. Yes, the front of the train is gonna be beautiful. Guys, check it out. The front of my train is done. It's gonna kind of be melon themed. And by that, I mean it's a red train. And then we just gotta build. Yes. Yes, it's time to construct the body. And boom. Guys, this is looking pretty snazzy. I'm not gonna lie. I just gotta build the bottom now and it'll be done. Okay, guys, let's take a look at what melon's been up to. What I've gotta do is equip my my x-ray glasses and bang i should be able to see straight through oh <gasps> melon you're working on a train bro that's actually an epic land vehicle they're so fast and heavy they can destroy anything in their path they're the most powerful vehicle in the world so <laughs> time for me to use my engineer's goggles the melon express beautiful and with the engineer goggles i should be able to clone his build and make it even better. Just gotta focus. Okay, now if I just place it here, it worked. Yo, check it out. But there's a few improvements I can make for this train to be even more epic. Now all I have to do when the judging starts is activate my wheels to really bring this build to life. And to do that, all I gotta do is start smelting things in this furnace. And just like that, my build is done. Just in time too. Hey, Hey, Dondale, it's time for you to pick whose build you think is better. Okay, Dondale, check out my build. Look at it. It's beautiful. Yo, you built a puny little train? Oh, uh, whatever. At least I'm not generic and I didn't build a car like you. Look at this. It's the Melon Express. It's a steam-powered train. Check this bad boy out. Plus, it even got a little light at the top. Yeah, you're kind of stupid, by the way. You built a melon train and you didn't even put a single wall. No, it's not supposed to be Melon Train. It's the Melon Express, Sonny. It's very different.
different. That's it. I'm putting watermelons in the front, so if it runs into a cow, the cow will die, and the watermelon will explode! You're pure evil, Sonny! Good thing this train doesn't move. Melon, feast your eyes on my build! What the heck? You also built a train? And what the heck? What are these blocks? What? Circles aren't supposed to exist in Minecraft. Yeah, and check it out. They can even spin! What the heck? Sonny, how did you build this thing? Power up! Choo-choo! Let's go! I must admit, Sonny has the better build this round. It even spins. Dondo, what the heck? The Melon Express was at least decent. <laughs> I told you the Melon Express needed a watermelon. Dang it, you're right. The theme for this next round is air vehicles. Anything that can fly. Planes, jetpacks, flying cars, anything. Whoa, air vehicles. That's my specialty. Bye, Melon. Sure, Sonny, sure. I've got a genius plan for this round. Uh, guys, I'm so lucky Melon is stupid. He didn't notice that I have these engineering goggles on my head. Oh, that could have been bad. Guys, I can't believe Sonny also built to train and it was moving this round i'm gonna build something he would never expect a helicopter this dude's probably building a plane so generic yep she's gonna make the tracks yeah that looks good that'll be the first helicopter landing stick thingy my bob i don't really know what you call it second one down and time to start building the base of the helicopter bada bing bada boom yeah that's nice that is nice yeah that looks a lot better that's looking more like a heli chopper. And now it's time to use my x-ray glasses to see what Melon's building. Just gotta put these on. Yes. What is he up to? Wait, that kind of looks like the body to... I have no idea what he's actually working on right now. Wait a second. I think I know what he's building. Those look like helicopter blades on the top. To be honest, at first I thought he was working on like Santa's sleigh or something stupid for his flying build, but it's clearly a helicopter. Now all I have to do is equip the engineer's goggles and I should be able to steal his build. <laughs> Did it work? Did it work? It worked! And I have an improved build. All that's left to do is add my propellers and make them function like a real helicopter. All I need now is to grab a shaft and some slabs of choice. I think I'll go with... Hmm... Smooth crystal quartz, yeah. And now I just glue my helicopter blades together. Oh, this is perfect. And one last section. It worked! Look at those propellers go! Okay, this is awesome. Now, what about the tail propeller? Melon helicopter. It's so beautiful. <gasps> Wait, check it out. Melon pilot. This is genius. Now, for this build, I'm gonna do the same thing, but vertically. Check it out. For the tail propeller, I'm gonna use these secret trap doors to make it look like it's made of iron. Then I just have to super glue a bunch of them together like this. Come on, this better work. Don't fail me now. Oh, that's gonna be awesome. And then I do the same thing down here. Get my super glue, my first secret trap door like this. Open it up. Destroy that, add the glue, and repeat. It's perfect. All I need now is a motor. This should do the trick nicely. Increasing the speed and activate. It's working. We have the main propeller and the tail propeller spinning. This is epic. Yo, Melon, you've got to check out my build. I will, Sonny, but first, you got to check out mine. I built the most awesome air machine ever. Yeah, is it better than my helicopter? You made a helicopter too? Yeah, and it actually has functioning propellers. What the heck, bro? What happens if I go in this in survival? Let's see. This is weird, Sonny. What is happening? I can't leave. Sonny, how are you doing this? First of all, how did you build a helicopter when I built a helicopter? Second of all, how are you making machine parts that actually spin? Because I'm a genius engineer. Let me just take these off really quick. Oh, wait, what did you say? You built a helicopter as well? Let's take a look. Bro, it's the melon copter. Look at it. It's beautiful. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> honestly, A plus for creativity. This is really nice. Yeah, even check out, check out the tail, bro. I made it into a melon slice. I see that. I see that. That way, when you're flying, you can always take a little snack. No, Sonny, don't touch it. Don't touch it. This is pure art. Right, Dondale? No, 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 melon. Don't get your hopes up. You definitely lost this round. Are you kidding me? What the heck? I'm gonna be honest, melon. I thought Dondale would give you the win. 
win? Because yours was more creative. Yeah, but Sonny's build is cooler because of the moving parts and stuff. <sighs> Dondale! Yo! He just likes mine because it has moving parts. <sighs> you are the worst, Dondale. Okay, guys, next round is going to be water vehicles like boats and such. Good luck. Like watermelon. <laughs> I have a genius plan. Once again, Sonny, I swear if you have the same build as me, I'm gonna be so annoyed. Bro, you keep building the same things as me. Stop copying me. Stop copying me. No, you're definitely copying me. You're up to something. Okay, guys. Melon's getting a little bit suspicious of me. So what I'm gonna do is actually choose my own build. Let's equip the old engineer's goggles. I'm picturing something a little more colonial. Yeah. Like a cool pirate ship. The ones with the big sails and wooden masts. Yeah. One of those. Engineer goggles. Help me out. Wow. She's beautiful. Look at this ship. It even has treasure. And emeralds and diamonds and gold. Yeah, there's no way Melon can top this thing. All I gotta do now is role play for a little bit. Schwab the decks. Hoist the main sail, ye hearties. Come on, scallywags. Ooh, I could make cannons. Okay, guys, I've got the base of my ship complete. It's time to lay out some decorations, build some sails, yada, yada, yada. Some buttons will be good. Yep, just really set the atmosphere. And just place a few of these down. And time to build some sails. And my build is complete. Guys, check it out. I modified the front of my ship to include a cannon. I am gonna destroy Melon's ship. I think for this round, we should remove the wall. Wait, why is the wall dropping? Yes! Oh, Melon. <laughs> Look at your tiny little sailboat. How the heck did you build this, Sonny? Carefully, meticulously, and with an extreme attention to detail. Like this here cannon. Wait, no. Don't tell me that thing actually works. Hold on. Let me just try it with potato cannon first. Uh. Schwab the deck! Repair the cannons! Fire! Fire! Sonny, you're not even hitting my ship. You think potatoes are gonna damage my ship? Okay, fine. Time to use the big boy. That thing probably doesn't even work, Sonny. It's just an art piece. Loading it up with dynamite times 20. Bro, I, like I said, it's an art piece. It's not actually gonna work. Fire! Fire! Wait, no. It's actually working. No, my ship. What the heck? What the heck? <laughs> this isn't even fair. Let's go. I knew my build was awesome. And this cute little cannon. Thank you so much for destroying his yacht. The theme of this final round will be space. So get creative and show me your best rocket ships and spacecrafts. And you just might win the grand prize. Did you hear that, Melon? A space round. I've got an idea, Sonny. You want to make all these things work properly? Properly, right? I'm actually gonna send my spaceship into space. Yeah, good luck with that, Melon. I'm just gonna work on something really cool, like maybe a floating meteorite. Or maybe I'll make dark matter. I'll just have an empty build that you can't see. That's stupid, Sonny. I'll win. Guys, it's time to begin constructing the rocket. Okay, bigger. After I model the first four thrusters, the rest is easy. And at this point, the build's pretty much done. Guys, check it out. The rocket ship is complete. Now I'm gonna spend the rest of my time working on a contraption to send this thing to space. It all starts with this lever. Guys, I wonder what Melon's up to. It's time for me to activate my x-ray glasses. Whoa. What is he up to? That's actually massive. His rocket ship looks awesome. Wait, what is he doing down here? Hold on. I need an invisibility potion to take a closer look. Just gotta sneak in there. See what this watermelon is up to. Wait, is he trying to make it so his rocket ship can actually fly? Bruh. Guys, according to my calculations, if I put redstone block, sticky piston, redstone block to sticky piston to slime block, I should be able to create an infinite loop, sending my rocket into the outer atmosphere and then eventually into space. That's it, guys. I'm gonna go inside of his rocket ship and fill it with TNT. Oh, yeah, it's time to sabotage him big time. Later. I filled his entire rocket ship with TNT. All that's left to do is cover it up and rewire his ignition switch. There it is. If I connect this to the TNT, it'll go kabammy! All I have to do is put on the back of the lever a redstone link containing a TNT and an ignition. Yes! Yes! And now it's time I build my own rocket ship. Couple blocks there. Then we need our captain's chamber to stay safe and secure. We need it to be 
an oxygenated facility. Something like this should be good. Oh, got to put my chair in there. There it is. Very nice. Now I can sit down comfortably as my rocket ship takes off. And then I just need the thruster underneath. And... Ooh, more thrusters. Maximum thrust. Yeah, that should do the trick. I don't need anything too fancy this round because Melon's whole ship's going to explode. And with this, the contraption is complete. Okay, Dondale, I'm ready to win. Melon, your build is insane. Yep, I know. It's insane. Let's see what you have. There's no way you can compete. Bro, your build is trash. That is terrible, Sonny. It's so small, tiny, puny, and disgusting. Meanwhile, my build is gigantic. I have high-tech thrusters at the bottom and a captain's chair. Check it out. I can sit down and be like, yes, prepare for liftoff. Houston, we have no problems. Sonny, it doesn't even work. And you know what's crazy? Mine actually works. Check this out. <laughs> no way. You put in real engineering? Dondale's gonna pick your ship for sure. Yep, I've had it with you, Sonny. Just gotta go up into my captain's seat. Enter survival mode. And now, Sonny, with the click of a button, <laughs> this entire ship will blast off. Don't you mean a flick of a switch? And yeah, blast off. Nice choice of words. What the heck's happening? What's happening? <laughs> What happened to my rocket ship, Sonny? I don't think you're going to space anytime soon. Was there a misfire? What happened? I don't have the whole bottom of my rocket ship. Yeah, that's gonna be a problem. It's hard to go to outer space without the thrusters. See ya! Ow! Congratulations, Sonny. Your tiny little rocket ship, considering it's the only rocket ship remaining, is the winner. How could this have happened? You should have stayed in school, bruh. Messing with rocket science? That stuff is dangerous. Sonny, what are you wearing? Uh... Uh... Anyways, I won! Give me this meteor! Give me this meteor! Yes, the block of fiery metal. Wait, no, no, no. You're a cheater! You've been cheating this whole time! <laughs> You died again! Quandale! Quandale! I've got the alien meteorite! Please buy it from me! I wanna be rich! Wait, my creative mode! It's gone! That's no worries. Hey, Quandale, would you would you buy this from me, please? Yeah, please. I don't want it. I think it's radioactive or something. Get that away from me. Wait, what do you mean you think it's radioactive? No! 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 Sonny just died so hard he left the server. That's cosmic karma. And if you guys want good cosmic karma, make sure to like and subscribe. Ugh, Melon, why do we always make our house like this? I don't know, Sonny. I'm tired of it. I'm tired of the gray walls everywhere. Check it out. You're right here. Gray wall. Gray wall. What is with these gray walls? Hey, at least you got a white quartz wall right here. Isn't it beautiful? No, it's ugly, Sonny. And it's way too hot in here, bro. It's summertime. We need, like, a nice cold house to cool us down. You're crazy! No chance, bro! I need a hotter house! I need something with greater levels of heat! I need something with radiation! Oh, I want something in the nether. No, 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 Sonny, we're not doing a nether house. We agreed we're doing a cold house this time. I get to make the cold house. It's gonna be awesome. What do you mean we decided? I don't remember that, but I do agree. This place is boring, and it's it's time for an upgrade. And there's only one way to settle this. Yeah, what's that? Build battle! Let's do this! You're done, Sonny. I've got a plan up my sleeve. Yeah? You think you have a plan? I'm gonna go talk to Dr. Longbottoms. <laughs> well, I'm gonna talk to the coldest individual I know. You're done for, Sonny. You're done for! Hey, what? You gonna go look in the mirror? That's not a bad idea, actually. Bro, you are cringe. Okay, guys, I gotta go find Dr. Longbottoms, and he He's gonna help me make the hottest, most evil. Mostly because it'll have lava and netherrack and magma blocks and stuff. But ultimately, it's gonna be a hot house. Yes, let's do this. Sometimes, guys, the realest and coldest person you know is yourself. Yo, what's going? What's popping? You looking drippy. Is that ice on your wrist? Oh, wait, you don't have any arms. But that's all right. Listen here. I wanna make the nicest, 
coolest house of all time. Wait, it's already done? I've journeyed far and wide, and this must be his place. Dr. Longbottoms. Wait, uh, yo, what happened to you? You look different, bruh. Ah, uh, hello, Sonny. One of my recent experiments went wrong, and I accidentally turned myself into a minion. <laughs> well, I guess it's not too bad. You do still look like a doctor, at least. And you've got a really nice oh. official mustache. Press the video on screen to keep watching this story.